As we continue to break down the 2023 Fordham football Rams, we move to the defensive side of the ball with a look at the defensive line. The Rams returned three of the four starters from 2022, led by graduate student captain Alfonso Dixon, seniors Eli Armstrong and Richard Hofus, along with sophomore Matt Jaworski, who missed part of the season due to injury. Dixon started all 12 games, recording 29 total tackles, including eight for loss and two and a half sacks last year. He was third on the team in tackles for loss. Armstrong appeared in 11 games on the defensive line last fall, starting seven. He recorded 15 total tackles, including three and a half for a loss and one and a half sacks. Hofus also played in all 12 games in 2022 for the Rams, starting seven, and made 26 total tackles, including one and a half for a loss. Jaworski, a preseason All-Patriot League pick, saw action in eight games as a sophomore, starting five on the defensive line. He finished with 22 total tackles, including five and a half for a loss and a team-high five sacks. Other experienced players returning to the defensive line include seniors Jason Walker, who appeared in seven games last year, making four total tackles and forcing a fumble, and Amir Lyles, who did not see action as a junior, along with juniors Jack Lowe, who appeared in all 12 games last year while making 18 total tackles, and Tristan Wright, who saw action in four contests last year, making four stops. The Fordham defensive line also returned seven sophomores, including Claudia Robinson, Sam Burkle, Colby Spencer, Michael Thorne, Chris Tuck, Peter Shaloub, and Ryan Zolnick. Robinson appeared in 10 games as a freshman, starting two, and making 12 total tackles, including two and a half for a loss, while Burkle saw action in all 12 games as a rookie, making one start, and recorded 13 total tackles, including four for a loss and four sacks. Spencer did not see action in 2022, while Thorne appeared in one game as a freshman. Tuck did not see action as a rookie last fall, while Shaloub appeared in 11 games as a freshman, recording eight tackles, including one sack, and Zolnick did not see action in 2022. The Rams also welcomed four newcomers to the defensive line. Freshman Aiden Jeter, a member of three Class 6A state championship teams at Bedford High School in Bedford, Georgia. Kevin Nizalek, who earned first-team All-New England honors last year at Avon Old Farms in Avon, Connecticut. John Scott III, who led the state college area high school team to the semifinals of the state championship last fall. And Walker Hicks, who played high school football at Cambridge High School in Milton, Georgia. Alfonso, how's uh, camp been going so far? Camp's going amazing. Everybody's working on all cylinders. It's uh, it's exciting to see everybody working in the same direction. So you have a new defensive coordinator this year who moved up you know, from linebackers coach. How's that transition going? Uh, it's going amazing. Coach Gant really knows his players. He knows what we like, and he knows how to get us to play fast. Now you also have a new uh, coach on the D-line. It looks like he brings, he brings some enthusiasm to the game. You guys seem to really be together out there. Yeah, him and uh, Coach Leonard. They kind of bring us together in a way I've never seen before. You know, I've been here for a long time, and uh, the energy is definitely different. And you mentioned you've been here for a long time. What factored into you coming back for the extra year? Uh, the team, man. Uh, I love my guys. I love my boys. And I got another chance to play college football, and I'm in the greatest place in the world. So, Great. Thanks, Alfonso. Appreciate it.